Hi, right, everybody doing that thing, YouTube land. I'll call some Curtis. What I got in my hand here is a Samsung Galaxy Tablet E. 9.6 inches of screen. It's like 10 inches of screen. Right now, I'm, I'm going to upgrade to NuGet. 7.1.1. Stay tuned, y'all. It's going to be good. How you guys doing out there, YouTube land? I'm Carl Stone Curtis. Like I said before, I'm upgrading my um, Samsung Galaxy Tablet E to NuGet 7.1. And pretty much, I'm going to break down the phone for those of y'all not aware of this Samsung Galaxy Tablet E, which came out last year, 2016. So right now, you got on the um, Tablet E, you got the uh, 5.0 rear um, camera, megapixel camera, you got the speaker, Samsung logo, pretty much in the back, and right here you got the micro SD card, cable enough to take up to uh, 128 gigabytes from the uh, micro SD card. You got the power button, and also you got the uh, volume rocker. And also you got the port. If y'all guys can see it, I mean the port is pretty much on the top of the phone. I mean top of the um the tablet with a, a standard um jack, headphone jack. Okay. Like I said before, it's upgrading and hopefully it'll be finished. Because I'm actually trying to cut down time because we all know how Samsung um pretty much upgrade it lasts I mean it could take a while for actually upgrade but as you see right now it's upgrading and pretty much you got a right here you got a 2.0 megapixel camera in the front and you got the home button and pretty much I'm gonna break it down to you what this bad boy about it's a 9.6 gorilla glass screen you see right here and also, um, the pixels is 1280 times 800 pixels. And you got a 1.2 um, gigahertz, gigahertz quad processor. And also, you got like 1.5 gigs of RAM. A lot of RAMs in this bad boy. And also, got an eternal 16 gig uh, memory inside the uh, Samsung Galaxy E tablet and pretty much um, what it does in um, resolution 1080 1080p the highest resolution 1080p so it's perfect for watching movies um, playing video games do all types of stuff on this um, tablet here now I know many people pretty much complaining about the glitches on this um, Samsung tablet uh, Galaxy E but actually when I bought this last year 2016 I didn't have no glitches with the um, Samsung Galaxy tablet um, E but for those of y'all still wondering what it still glitch after it finished updating to the um, Nougat 7.1 you're gonna find out. You're gonna find out that um, the seven point um, seven point one nougat actually fixed the glitching problem, which so much people are talking about with the um, Samsung um, Galaxy Tablet E. So right now it's upgrading, and we had um, it's optimizing apps. 45 apps out of 120. Now the reason why I don't pretty much root this um, device here with King Root or uh, any other third party apps because I was waiting for the um, Samsung Galaxy release an update to the um, Samsung Galaxy E which by the way they did they released an update to Nougat 7.1 so pretty much I kept everything running clean and now upgrading the tablet E to Nougat 
7.1. It's almost finished, y'all. Right now, it's got like um, 60 apps out of 120. We all know the Samsung, especially you, you own Samsung product, it actually take a while to finish the upgrade because they got to pretty much optimize these apps. Right now I'm just pretty much waiting. I really don't have no problem here with this tablet. This tablet working just fine after a year owning it. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'm still using this tablet. And it's like sort of like a, a big version of the um, Galaxy Note 8. That's what it's a bigger version. Why the um, S Pen? Because pretty much we all know that the... Uh, most of your people don't know that the uh, Samsung Galaxy um, Tablet E don't come with no S Pen. But I really don't need an S Pen because it's a, a bigger screen because it's like a 9.6 inch of screen. It's like 10 inch of screen. So I really don't need the, um, the tablet. I pretty much use my fingertips. And we had um, 88%. Let's see. And also, it's the um, it's the um, wi the um, Wi-Fi version. As you know, it's it's not it's not running on no data. I got this pretty much running on Wi-Fi. It's the wi it's the um, Wi-Fi version. Samsung Galaxy Tablet E. Like I said before, so many people is complaining about the glitching problem from the um, Samsung tablet uh, Galaxy E. But I haven't received no glitches. Like I said before, I haven't received a glitch. I bought this tablet last year, 2016, and um, I haven't seen no glitches, what people are actually talking about. But um, I'm just waiting because right now when they first came out, I was running on KitKat. And I waited patiently. I was running on KitKat. I was waiting. I was actually waiting for the um, nougat to come out. It was talks about bringing the nougat from the um, Samsung um, Galaxy Tablet E. Well, here you go. I'm gonna wait till it finishes booting up. There you go. Um, excuse me. You know, I can show you the pen of this thing here. There you go. Actually, a lot of things change. They change the apps. They change everything. I haven't seen no glitches at all to this thing yet. No glitches. Okay, I'm going to go for the settings. I'm pretty much... Trying to find the settings. See, they change anything. Go to settings. And go down to about tablet. And pretty much software information. And it's running on Nougat. 7.1.7. Wow, I'm impressed. This bad boy is actually running on um, 7.1.1. Wow. Then the guy not surprised because, like I said before, the, uh, the um, Samsung. One thing I know about Samsung, um, the Santa the Samsung product, especially the Samsung Galaxy product, it never let me down. Like I said before, I haven't seen no glitches at all. It's no glitches. Actually, um, it's one of the latest thing. It's one of the latest 
um, firmware, which is um, NuGet 7.1.1. I actually thought it's gonna run. Um, it's gonna run. It's gonna run um, NuGet like the first edition of NuGet. But then again, you know, you know how powerful um, um, Samsung Galaxy um, products is, especially the electronic side, especially the tablet. I'm not surprised they actually moved the uh, Samsung um, Galaxy Tablet E and move it up to um, running um, NuGet 7.1.1. I'm going to show it to y'all guys again because pretty much uh, most of y'all guys don't believe it, but there it is. It's running um, Android NuGet 7.1.1. All right, this is quite some Curtis here. Stay tuned, y'all, because I'm going to do a benchmark test um, for the um, Samsung Galaxy Tablet E. Till next time, this is Quiet Stump Curtis. Till next time we meet again, guys. Later.